Hey, it's Paul Hobart coming to you from the OP Indoor Golf Facility here in Columbus, Ohio. Got a quick tip for you today on getting into a good setup position. This is going to be vital to being able to hit good shots, make a good turn, get good distance, all those things that we're all looking for. Okay, now I've got my mat here. I got a nice place to practice indoors. I'm using my alignment aid. So I got a lot of good stuff that I'm doing here. But one thing I want you to work on, and I'm going to give you a little exercise here, is to get into a great posture before you start your swing. One way to do that, take a golf club or a broomstick or a speed stick or whatever you have, put it back behind your neck, behind your shoulders, and hang on to it. Then we're going to work into a good golf stance. So we got feet about shoulder width apart, a little bit of knee flex so we get some spring in the legs, and then we're going to go from this very tall position, we're going to tilt the whole upper body over. Okay, so I'm keeping my back pretty straight. It's going to be a little bit of a stretch for some of you after the winter time. Back stays pretty straight, letting my rear end kind of stick out a little bit to balance me. And now I'm in a good position to really make a nice turn into my backswing. One mistake that we see an awful lot of, especially with the guys, is people getting over the ball and slumping over, letting those shoulders round over, getting the spine and the back into a bad position. So again, we want to stay nice and tall, shoulders back. Good balance, tilt over, and then you can go ahead and bring your golf club down, make a nice swing, and get some good contact. It's a great drill to get you in a good spot to be able to make a nice swing, a nice back swing, and hit some really good shots. Work on that before the season gets here. If you want to learn more about that or about golf lessons with me, visit paulhobartgolf.com. See you soon.